Well, it's not even Labor Day yet, but some students in our area already back in school. I know. It is actually the first day of school for children in the Jericho School District. Eyewitness News reporter Stacy Sager, they're like, what happened to the summer, Stacy? <laughs> I don't know. It just flies by, Dave, doesn't it? You know, we're here at the Cantiag Elementary School in Jericho. The good news is the morning rain held off just long enough. The kids got in. They're dry. They're safe. Most importantly, they are happy. You know, Jericho has a longer school calendar than most, but they are ready. Yep, we got kids. Busloads of kids and smiles as this first day of school here in Jericho got off to a great start. 400 students returning like the summer went by in a blink. New hair, new haircut, I like it. Nah. For Principal Joseph Sapienza, the first day here at Cantiag Elementary is one of the best. The theme for this year, together we can tiag, with the goal, more functional learning, that is, the blending of their real world with their school world. It even okay. started today with these second graders and their books. Tell us why that one's your favorite. Because it shows a lot of history. <gasps> to bring in their own texts from outside, whether it's something that they saw at home or something out in the community. Hard to tell who was most excited, the littlest kindergartners maybe, assessing. It looks good. So far so good? <laughs> or their parents. Oh, it's a lot. You know, it's, uh, it's, we've been waiting for this for quite some time. And there's the slightly older siblings speaking with relative certainty about the coolness of this first day. First day of school because I don't have to do any homework. <laughs> Very smart. Very smart. Jericho is among the first to start the school year. A few others starting later this week, but most start next week. And while there's always those first day jitters. She's nervous about the new teachers, making sure if her friends are in the classroom. Inside the building. Let's all take a deep breath together. One and let it out. A new beginning with nothing but the highest the hopes. One. How do you feel about first grade? What's going through your mind today? Uh, the, the fun part. The fun part. Very good answer. Now, as we said, Jericho does have a longer school calendar. They have 186 days on their calendar as opposed to the state mandate, which is only 180 days. That's because they celebrate pretty much every holiday and they want to leave a lot of room for snow days. Yes, it's August and I'm talking about snow days.